This shit is a waste of time. Why are they doing this to me? <laughs> Why Nancy Pelosi in the quarry? <laughs> Ask for Granny's OnlyFans. Yeah, and you got bit twice. And yet you look fine. Did it not even take a chunk? It is way harder to get people killed in this one. And until dawn, people got their fucking heads sliced off by the Wendigo. Does anyone love hearing his own voice more than Neil Cuckman? He's pretty far up there, yeah. I love how he wants to retroactively ruin the first Last of Us. Just to show the world that Joel was a bad guy all along, guys. I can't believe you'd empathize with... with you can tell the wine is starting to hit me. Black stuff? That's- that's infection. That's- and it's- it, it's spreading. This is bad. He's gonna turn into something. We should amputate. <sighs> really? You gonna do that, bro? Before the infection spreads. What? This really is, like, fucking zombie shit. Whatever. Why would we do that? I don't know, man. Look at that black stuff. What- what do you think it is? Do I look like a doctor? This gay dude is just not- He- he's... Almost as- No, actually- He's as bad as at least the hot chick. Like, I, I, what the fuck? Not as bad as Sweet Life over there, but Sweet, Sweet Life, she's the worst. No, don't call out. What is with this all call out bullshit? There's no call outs. Look, if she's the trained marksman, which is retarded, but if she is, why not give her the shotgun? The real quarry was in our hearts the whole time. Do a based walkthrough, save only the guys. Mm, I don't even like most of the guys. I, I saw a fucking body in the lake. Like, a dead one? Oh, no, 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 no. Um, one of the, one of the swimmers from the varsity swim team, he got lost on the way to practice and it was... Yes, a dead one, dumbass. Of course you did, Jacob. No, for real, I did. I, I figured it must have been one of the counselors that didn't show up, but I couldn't tell because it was like all, all bloaty and gross. Something's not right. Yeah. Hey, I need this, okay? <laughs> Just take the gun. <laughs> Just get the second gun from the fucking lodge. No, I'm trying to save my girlfriend's life, asshole. Yeah, I don't think she's your girlfriend, dude. Holy shit, just relax. Alright, give him the gun. Fuck it. He's the guy I want to live anyway. Fuck. Oh. Okay. Yeah, just get let him get hit. <laughs> I did that on purpose. Jacob, we're keeping this. Nick and Abby are injured. We need protection. There's someone around here. <laughs> Brian. Sorry. This is bullshit. That was completely pointless. That was all complete. Oh my god, man. How hard is it to just do the thing you did before? And then improve on that thing. How many times do I have to fucking say this? This is why I hate modern gaming. God damn, dude. It's literally just worse than Until Dawn. It is just worse. Alright, can we kill her now? Is it time for her to die? Okay, full disclosure. I've suddenly found myself on a, a strange, tiny little island all alone with nothing to do. <laughs> Over there. You know what? She deserves to die just for polluting YouTube or TikTok or Instagram with her this shitty content. You know? You know, I, I, <laughs> I'm saving this platform. She's killing it. She's gotta die. What is wrong with her mouth? I, man, I don't know. Face scan or something. Who knows? Do you think she's a synthetic man subscriber? No. No. That's gonna get clipped and used to make it sound like you're talking about a real female YouTuber, lol. Uh, <laughs> can you imagine? Well, I have this recorded, so if that ever happens, I can just play back this clip and save my ass. I'm putting the controller down. If she dies, she dies. Do I continue on the path I'm on and keep ranting about my stupid dumb life? Yes, keep ranting, attract the monster. It's very realistic that a TikTok woman would be ranting about herself in the woods while dressed in her underwear. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Did we ever figure out what, what she's famous from? Is she really a uh, born star? Are you guys fucking with me? I feel like you're fucking with me. It did- Okay, did we find out who she is for real? People said Lana Rhodes. It's not fucking Lana Rhodes, is it? I mean, I'm just get Listen, I'm saving her from herself. When she reaches her 30s and can't get a single decent guy to commit to her and her egg carton is 90% empty, 
you know, she's gonna have a life of depression because no guy is good enough for her. So I'm saving her the trouble. That's all I'm saying. Did you hear that? Looks like we have a choice on our hands. Wow, dude, it's more meta humor. This is the worst character I've ever seen in anything. Yeah, I know. I thought Brenda Song's character was the worst, but she, this, this chick has ascended. Goodbye, cruel world. The final curtain is calling and there's no time for an encore. Why was the monster up there? That's it? That's how she dies? That was pretty anticlimactic. At least I got her killed. That, that is what I tried to do. That was kind of shitty, though. I wanted her to die in a more dramatic fashion, you know? <laughs> I love it. This is the most active chat has been the whole stream. Is literally just like, yes, woo, yeah, she died, bro, she died. Yeah, it took us, oh my god, you're right. Three and a half hours in this stream, finally somebody died. God damn, this game sucks. Three hours already and nothing happened. Yeah, that was the first real thing. I have been trying to sabotage this playthrough. And it won't let me do it, dude. Really the worst part is the dark the pictures, so like so anthology, long. even though they were mediocre, yeah, they would have been almost right. over by now. I think they were only like five hours long each, so I would have been, you know, over halfway. Yeah, this might be eight hours long. Who the fuck knows? I hope not. It better be only like six hours. Okay, then 911. You mean 911? Who says 911? I don't know. What is this fucking dialogue, dude? What are you doing? I don't know. It's what they do in movies when the phone goes dead. You tap on the little thingy. We're not in a movie. There's How way too much me meta humor in this. Meta humor you could do maybe twice at the most. This is the third time already. Why is he the guy who gets a shotgun? I hate to say this because I hate her character, but give it to the to the Asian chick. Brenda song, right? Give it to her, because we already know she knows how to use a gun. For whatever reason, she does. So why do you have the fucking gun? I love how the two guys with guns are going to the same location and are leaving the rest of the people to die. I think that's a good idea. A really good idea. Yeah, we should probably leave that with Caitlyn. Yeah, actually, he actually did bring it up. Thank God. Yes, yes, give it to her. Wait, what? Not- oh my- this- I hate this guy. I fucking hate this guy. She really needs it, though. Uh, she needs it just as much as we do. Yes. She's staying in the lodge. We're going out there. You literally just said there might be something dangerous in the lodge. When? Like, 20 seconds ago. Okay, sure. Caitlyn is Korean. Yeah, she's a rooftop gun, Korean, that's for sure. Yes, give her the gun. I don't even like her, but give her the gun. We're probably gonna kill her anyway, who cares? Don't write a check that your ass can't cash. My ass has got quite the bank account. No. I'm never letting it happen. Unless it forces me to make them, you know, like kiss or worse. I'm not doing it. Don't forget to like and subscribe <laughs> if you want to see more. This game is the lamest, gayest haunted house I've seen. That's funny. Who made this game super massive? The developers of Until Dawn and the Dark Pictures Anthology. Until Dawn is the only good game they've made. And it's not even a game, right? But every movie game that they've made afterward is worse. Oh yes, two of the- both of the infected people are together. So they're gonna turn and like kill everybody else. Seems a good idea. They don't even have real bite marks. This is a blood texture on their models. Supermassive is a fucking joke. They suck. I should make a highlight video just in place for a review. Just to fucking just shit on these motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Fuck these guys. We're only halfway. We're only halfway. God damn it. Can I speed run this? If everyone dies, we'll, we'll cut like parts of the game. Because I think Until Dawn did that. If, if you die, like it would skip scenes. Because certain characters went on their own adventures, I remember. So, but but I didn't... I The only person who died when I played was the blonde chick at the beginning. Because I fucked up the quick time events. Everyone else lived. 
So I got to play pretty much everything. Campers have Actman levels of conflict resolution. Jeez. <laughs> uh, that's rough. I don't think I'm going to comment on that that whole thing. I mean, this actual gaming shit going on right now, anyway, and... Look, I like YouTube drama as much as the next guy. But I said my piece, I didn't really do my research. Some people informed me of details I wasn't aware of. All I know is, I don't think he deserves to lose his channel over the whole thing, but I will say he definitely needs to accept some of the blame. I think his ego got too big. That's about the most I'll say on it. I love Actman, but he's the perfect example of being killed by policies he helped push. His ego is out of control. In the end, he doesn't deserve it, but he should have just quit while he was ahead. It, it sort of does seem that way, where it's like, in trying to take down this guy, he just fucking, he went way too far. I feel like giant YouTubers ganging up on a lesser channel, even if the dude, I don't know, supposedly, Quantum TV is, like, you know, right-wing dude, so... It's weird because Actman made like, I know. he made like an anti Anita Sarkeesian video like four years ago or maybe five years ago. So did his politics get corrupted by people in his audience? Maybe the Discord? Like Discord, people ask me why I don't have a fucking Discord. Discord only brings trouble. It doesn't do anything good for anybody. Synth, yes, his new audience consisted of rainbow crybabies, so he apologized like Chris Raygun for his old views. Did he actually do that, or is that speculation? Because if he did, that's gay as hell. The redneck guy. Why is it the redneck guy? Why is he here? Is he trying to cure them with the shit? Or was that just blood to keep them off their scent or something? I don't know. What is that? I don't even know what that was supposed to be. Well, whatever. I'm not pressing anything, so it's fine. No, I'm not pressing anything. There you go. That's the most realistic thing that's happened so far. Alright, I'm not touching the controller. We don't care about these characters. They're not the main character. They're side characters. Just like real horror movies, only one person lives. Or maybe two at the most. These motherfuckers deserve to die. I got you, girl. So is he gonna kill her because she's infected or something? Is that what's happening? Really? It's... Nope, not touching. Whack -a -mole. <laughs> what? Oh, he is infected. I knew it. Why would I hit A if I know he's infected and evil? He needs to die. Did that even do anything? Not hitting A? What the hell? This giant hillbilly guy. I know that. I know they're. They probably have super strength from being infected with a thing, but they need to die, dude. Get him, hillbilly. Get him. Sneed has to win. I just realized that I no longer really care about graphics. This game looks really good, but I am neither impressed nor do I care about it. I used to care about next gen improvements. Yeah, I'm with you with the graphics, dude. I don't even care anymore either. I don't- do we even care anymore? I mean, if I'm not even playing the game, I'm basically just commentating and watching cutscenes. This is like torture for me. So that man looks like he's on death row. Yeah, I am. This is- this game is slowly killing me, bro. That's another thing. I swear to you, Until Dawn had more parts where you actually, like, explored and grabbed evidence and stuff to, like, learn the backstory and, like, how... You know, the, the younger sister was the Wendigo because she ate the other sister. I remember that. I remember that. And then there's the secret ending and all that. This game is just, like, the, the actual gameplay part is completely pointless. Which is probably why they have a movie mode. I should have figured that out when it said, oh, movie mode. Yeah, because the fucking walking around uh, point and click adventure parts are fucking pointless. This, this is completely sorry, pointless. I'm... Kyle only highlight video. <laughs> yeah, when Jacob's on screen, that's it. Hello, my fellow Z Anon, South Winger, Dragon's Dogma Supremacist. Don't expect gore in games with celeb names, faces attached. It affects their brand. I wonder if they did get backlash to Until Dawn. You know, you know? 
I know, like, they, it was the TV actors in that, because there was the, the cheerleader from Heroes. There was the dude from Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. who turned into a bad guy. Was Remy Malik in it? I think Remy Malik was in it, too. He was the... the he went crazy after his sisters died. So anyway, the point is, is they got decapitated. So I wonder if after that, after they got decapitated, they complained about it. That is a good point, because I, I feel like... There's not much gore in it anymore. There was gore in Until Dawn. Oh my god, who the fuck cares? How Just do, do the horror this? shit. 360 like viewers. So, people obviously want to see this fuck face run. Probably because most most other people streaming this game right now probably are, are, you know, trying to save people. Me, I'm specifically trying to save one guy. That is... All these people can die. Jacob is the only one. Or Kyle. Is the only one who needs to live. Are they gay? Only the white guy is gay. The black guy... Who knows? Maybe it's up to player choice. Dude, just keep it simple, bro. What are you doing? Just to say, oh, my friends have been bitten by some animal, possibly a bear. Um, you know, I don't know. Stop. What the fuck is he doing? Why would you even let him speak? No, you fucked it up. Shut the fuck up. They're not even taking this seriously. Please, please, please stop. Stop, please. It's not funny. It's not, the horror part is started. The jokes, it's over. There's no more jokes at this part. This is the, the, the people die or they live part. There's no more jokes. Okay, yeah, the monsters out there. Fucking barricade the windows and the door. Do something. Is it a bear? Oh, yeah, the bear climbed on the fucking roof. Yeah, dude. Alright, this is... Listen, if you... Th this gives the stream some value, okay? If you want to see the run where only Jacob lives, that's what this stream is good for, okay? It has a purpose. It stands out in the algorithm, right? Okay? I would title it Jacob Only Run. Maybe I will tomorrow. If, if we don't finish tonight, which I guess we're probably not going to. I will title this Jacob Only Run when we start again tomorrow or Sunday or whenever. Wait, why are they out? Oh, right. They're outside because the redneck guy. Why did they even give you the option to shoot if there's nothing to shoot at? I guess to blast a hole in the roof for the monster to come in. Oh, shit. I just realized. Did we get jabated? If I had shot, would the monster have killed them? Doing nothing might have actually helped us there. I just realized that. Fuck. Uh, aggressive. Well, aggressive will probably get us killed. <laughs> good idea, good idea. We gotta kill it, bro. We need a super gun. We need the AK-50. <laughs> well, I know people wanted another, like, real drunk stream out of me. Well, here we are. Here we are, guys. Whoa! Whoa! What the fuck? Well, shit's happening. Shit's happening. Uh, I'm not just gonna do nothing. Let's see what happens if you do nothing. Can I shoot him? Because he's infected. Can I shoot him in the head? That'd be cool. Shoot him in the head. He's infected. He's infected! Kill him! Three of them are infected. Three of them. I wouldn't call that safe by any metric. Man, I don't even care anymore. I'm just waiting for the part where they start like eating each other. How long does it take for the infection to take hold? Oh my god. What is it the hot chick that they kill her before she could turn? I didn't even get a good look, dude. Did you guys get a good look? Was I just paying that little attention? Oh my god, dude. I thought this was supposed to be horror. Stop playing the fucking There's no way it was our boy. There's no way. They killed our boy off screen. I will quit this game right now. I promise you. I will. If it was, like, fuck this game, unironically. Yeah, see, there we go. Jacob. We're back to Jacob again. Naked and afraid. Emma! Oh, right. I better hold the controller. Oh, shit. I hope I'm not too drunk to do basic quick time events, guys. I, I, I can't fuck this Emma, up. Do I need to chug, chug my water until, until 
He must live. There has to... <laughs> there has to be a unique value to this stream. And it's a Jacob only run. That is that is the, the gimmick of this goddamn stream. But whatever, man. You gotta have one character you care about. And and that makes it more like a horror movie anyway, let's be real. You know, actually, now that I think about it, there was a like a trap door that got a character killed in the original Until Dawn. I think it was like the, the dude with the glasses, wasn't it? So that was probably a reference getting the hot chick killed. A memory card. Ooh. What, dude, you're, he's not even wearing pants. He just like, yes, let me let this, this memory card nestle near my balls. That'll, that'll keep it safe. <laughs> yes, two memory card, Pog. <laughs> yeah. yeah, maybe it is his prison wallet, yeah. You might be onto something. Oh my god. Where the hell is she? Bro, she's dead. I got her killed. And she had it coming. Uh, yeah, hide, please. Alright, I, I need to concentrate. He has to live. This is our main character. Oh, shit. Okay, yeah, du duck down. Why does this have to happen? They're trying to kill him. I want him to live. Uh, yeah, we'll hide. We'll hide. Why? We'll okay, it's probably gonna have me a whole day. Oh, there we go. Alright, go for it. Run. They want to kill him. They're trying to kill him. Fuck the developers of this game, dude. They're literally trying. God damn it. No, you can't pull free. Okay, so I guess try and pry it open. I don't even think that would work. I'm pretty sure that wouldn't work. Why does this have to happen to the only decent character? Look, you could. Fuck. Okay, well, it was. It was. The good guy, more or less. I didn't get bit, so I'm fine. I'm good. He's good. He's safe. Wait, what? Uh, so it was her. I knew it, but how'd she die? I. Oh wait, what do you mean? I I got her killed. What am I talking about? Oh, wait, is it a different character? Just flip her over, dude. Nick, you smell so good. But uh. She's infected too. I guess he was bit more times since he was bit like 10 times. But she was bit twice, so she should also be like feeling something, right? Taste you. Hey. Come here. Nick, what the hell? Shoot him. He's infected. Wait, what? Water kills them? No, come on. Don't make this like signs. That's stupid. Really? Oh man, this deadly creature is uh, weak to, you know, what the world is covered. 70% of the earth is covered in water. Really? This is fucking dumb. Unless it's holy water. Really, it's- uh, is it holy water? Please don't tell me it's actually holy water. That's fucking dumb. Kill him. He's infected. It's every goddamn zombie movie. Or just like douse him in water, throw him in a fucking shower or something. Right, so we found the one daughter who died and the dude is just completely fine with this. Did he sacrifice his children to the hag? Which, I guess the hag is just kind of bullshit and it's really just like a, a, a zombie that is suspiciously similar to the Wendigo. I'm just glad I'm not playing as Jacob so I don't need my mental faculties as much because they're really starting to fade, guys. There's... I'm trying to hold it together. When does he? <laughs> Holy shit. Do you like Asian women? I don't know. I'm I'm neutral. Does that count? Like, I, I'm not one of those, like, incel type of people who are like, yes, uh, I will go to Southeast Asia and pick up my underage wife or something. I, I'm just saying, you know, like, yeah, sure, why not? I mean, it's not like, it's not one of my preferences necessarily, but I don't think I really have a type in that way, you know what I mean? 
Holy shit! Whoa, Abby. Uh, Abby, everything okay? Threw her across the room. How is she fine? Okay, can we kill her, him now? Is this the part where we shoot him? He's obviously not human anymore. He just threw a woman across the room. Yeah, okay, shoot. I will shoot. Yes. There we go. Yeah, shoot him. Now shoot him in the head. What? Why why would his what? This is just dumb. This is dumb. The skin like flies off their body, really? Come on. Come on. This is dumb. Also, she's infected. Has the game forgotten she's been bitten twice? She should be turning now too, right? Mongolia greater than modern Japan, China, and Korea. Yeah. A Mongolian wife would probably make some Chad sons. It's taking so long to get these people killed. Don't trust them. Shoot them through the door. Don't let me in. It's not safe out here. Yeah, no shit. There's a crazy woman with a gun killing people. I'm not killing people. Holy shit. You, Laura Kearney? You're Laura Kearney? Yeah. You were supposed to be working, uh, helping out in the nurse's office, right? And you never showed up? You and the guy. What's his name? Max? Yes, Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Hackett said that you had changed your mind last minute. I, I think that we should. I think that we should listen to her inside. Let's just focus on talking to a girl first, chat. Then we can worry about whether or not they're Asian. <laughs> Look, we're going for the fuck face run. We're not trusting any bitch. Oh, yeah. Do you agree? She's Naughty Dog ruined video games. Like we started getting yeah, games that are like TV yeah. shows and not video games like Prey. I mean, you can't blame Naughty Dog alone. I would certainly say Naughty Dog, ironically, when they became more respected is when they became more shitty. You know, Crash Bandicoot, Jack and Daxter, beloved franchises, mascots, characters we love. Uncharted, I don't know, Uncharted 2 is fun to play one time, and then you're like, well, you know, I've seen it all, there's no point in ever replaying it again. Like, it's just story shit and spectacle and huge events or whatever and then last of us one like it had a compelling story the gameplay is okay it's fine but like crash bandicoot 2 is fucking awesome jack 1 and 3 are great people are gonna not like my take on jack 2 so much i feel like opinionated junkie thanks to two bucks the boys would make a good game it would be interesting to play as um Normal humans trying to take out superheroes that that would be interesting. I don't know how what type of game that would be All right fine. We'll see what's in the crystal ball just in case it saves Jacob our boy Crash 2 was my first game. So base synthetic man. Yeah, it's awesome. I love crash 2. That was so, definitely uh, one of my childhood games We did come One night early That was our mistake Oh, it's that oh my god. It's the chick from the beginning. Okay, so they tied it in with the beginning. They tied it in with the beginning. Okay, so she survived, and obviously he got eaten by the thing, whatever the thing is. And so she got injected by that weird, creepy cop. All right, well, I guess they tied it in with the beginning. That's kind of neat. Did you like Crash 4? I did. I actually did review it. Nobody watched that video. Yeah, I think it catered way too much to speedrunners and them hiding the boxes just wasn't really that fun. I thought it was a decent enough game, but definitely not as good as Crash 2. They went too far. They tried to cater to like the speedrunner type audience. You know, kind of like Doom Eternal. Not as bad as Doom Eternal, but you know, I don't know. Eh, there's shit in it. It was just kind of not that fun. This game is poop. Excuse me? <laughs> she hit the wall overnight. That is hilarious. Honestly, she never really looked that good. Uh, lash out. Whatever. She can't die here. She literally... I mean, she's in the future, so it doesn't matter. Like, nothing you do here matters. This is so stupid. This might as well just be a cutscene that's like 30 seconds long. Like, why give you choices if you survive? Wait, what? He's alive? Was he dragging a different body into the prison? 
So a different body was dragged over there. Well, he's bitten, so he's going to turn into one, as we already know. This game is paused, though. People were saying, like, is it woke? Yes, it is. It is. You'll notice all the female characters are pretty much the ones that are doing the manly things. I mean, it's pretty much undeniable. Like, it is way too noticeable now, where even when I'm drunk, I'm like, yeah, nah. Why am I examining the spoon again? Just pick it up if you're going to take it. Wait, what? I already looked at the spoon. You're telling me I needed... Oh my... Fuck games like that. Fuck it. games like that. If you need the spoon, pick up the spoon before examining the brick. I shouldn't have to look at the brick to know to grab the spoon. Just grab the spoon. Okay? Just grab the spoon. Her forehead is huge. Her forehead is Somalian. It's weird that she's covered in blood when he's the one who's bit, right? Am I remembering wrong? Why is she covered in blood and he looks fine? He was bit. That's not her blood. But if it's his blood, why isn't he bloody? That's my question, right? Why are they wasting so much time on this? Why are they wasting so much time on this? Fuck! Until Dawn was like five hours, I think. Tops. We are... Four... We are almost five hours into the stream. And even though I've taken a couple breaks... We are not even in the third act, so that's fucking great. Yeah, this is a full price game, guys. Keep that in mind. If this flashback is supposed to reveal something, why is it like 30 minutes long, man? Like, it doesn't take that long to be like, oh man, the whole grand reveal, bro. Whoa. This is the fucking uh, Tormented Souls stream I did all over again. The one where I got super drunk. It was Rakaya Scott, right? Who I think he donated two hundred dollars. You saved this stream. I just I just want to tell you that because like I wasted sixty bucks plus tax on this piece of shit. This fucking bitch has like a eye patch like she's fucking uh you know, solid snake or or well big boss really. Big boss. Soy FaceTime. Dude what? Oh, there you go. Did you get what you wanted? I, I get pestered about this shit so much, I swear to God. <laughs> Flushed 70 dollars down the toilet bowl five minutes ago. Did I? Just let me I guess I did. Big Mom from One Piece. Uh, I don't know anything about One Piece. I mean, I, I vaguely know things about One Piece. Thank you, Synthetic Man, for paying for this so we don't have to. No problem. I think I will edit this into a highlights, and then hopefully that'll reach out to more people to convince them not to buy this. The problem is, there are so, so many people who buy games at launch and don't wait for reviews. Like, an insane amount of people. You know what's funny? I think ACG actually promoted this game. Listen, I know you guys have said it, and I agree with you, but, like... ACG, you can't fucking trust his opinion. I don't care if he doesn't get sponsors. The guy is just like a game journalist. He gives positive reviews so that he, he keeps getting keys no, no, no. for games. Because he knows getting time. early access is important to being relevant for the algorithm, yeah, right? So, who the fuck... I don't know. He, he doesn't have real opinions. He's not a real human being. You know what? He Carrick can come at me if he wants. He probably has no idea who the fuck I am anyway. Uh, if he did know who the fuck I am... I don't give a shit, man. He doesn't have real opinions. I'm sorry. He's not a real human. Make it stop! Make it stop! Hopefully, Xenoblade Chronicles 3 is good, so then I'll have another good game reviews here. And I'm hoping, I'm really hoping it's better than Elden Ring. You don't know how bad I don't want to give Elden Ring game of the year. You don't even know. Because it's like, imagine me, the guy who has one of the most critical reviews of Elden Ring. Of course, one of the most controversial because of Zoomer retards who, who can't handle a different opinion. Right? Imagine if that guy gives it game of the year anyway. Xenoblade Chronicles 3 better be fucking better. That's all I'm saying. Dude, this is so much worse than Until Dawn. It's not even okay. close. What the fuck happened to Supermassive? They had okay. one good game. Did There's everyone leave the company? Did Next every qualified developer leave up? after you Until Dawn? That is the real question. Really Listen, enough. all you know, 340 whatever of you who are still watching, you're a champian. 
You're the best. I I can't believe you're still watching this shit. That is impressive to me. I I don't know, man. This is like this stream sucks to me. It sucks anyway. But maybe you're entertained by my annoyance with the game. We haven't even seen Jacob in like an hour at this point. The main character, according to you know us, we all three hundred and whatever of us, we know Jacob's the main character. I don't know if they know he's the main character, but we know. <laughs> Anyone got ripped apart yet? Only the hot chick. Only the hot chick died, which is good because she was the worst character. And she died in the most anticlimactic way possible. The fucking, uh, and, and the, the, the Australian guy, he turned into one of them. So, I don't know if that counts as dead or not. Close enough, right? That's about it, though. Everyone else is fine. I mean, the, the dump, the dumpy chick, she's infected, but literally no, uh, no, uh, diff, you know, nothing has happened to her yet. It's typical zombie movie bullshit, yeah, right. where it's just completely inconsistent. The cop is men go their own way. <laughs> That's funny. I feel like you're starting to hate Elden Ring retroactively even more than in the review. Yeah, I don't. I don't hate Elden Ring. I. I. Um. I hate. Uh. The. The. Casual gaming audience. Cause let's be real right now. Let's be absolutely real. Elden Ring sold more than 13 million copies. Do you know what that means? That means it is mainstream. It is normie shit. By the end of this year, it could sell like 16, 17, 18 million copies. That is Call of Duty tier. That is what that is. So if anyone, and I mean literally anybody wants to claim that it means anything to beat a Souls game anymore, it fucking doesn't. It doesn't. It's all bullshit. I am done with, it is a mainstream franchise. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. Well, there you go. He turned into one. Yeah, I I knew the sheriff was trying to display that, obviously. Wait, shit. Does that mean she's... Oh, well, I mean, it slashed her eye out, which makes sense. There you go. That's why she's big boss in the future. What a weird zombie virus that, like, your skin blasts off of your body. This sucks. God, ACG is a hack. I'm just gonna say it. It's not like he would ever see this, anyway. Watch somebody in this chat be like, Oh, Synthetic Bear called you a hack. He'd just be like, who the fuck's that? I mean, that's what anybody says. Who who knows who I am? Nobody knows who I am. No, no, no bigger YouTuber. And you know what? That's the way I like it. Let's be honest. Either way, he's a hack. This game sucks. Hey, Synth, what do you think about Berserk coming back? I still haven't read Berserk. I know it's crazy. I still haven't read it. I, I need, really need to set aside a f at least a few hours to read some of it. You know, all I know is from memeing, like meme stuff and internet culture in general. We've only seen two characters, Morbin, and both were males. It's true. Is that the plot twist that women are immune to the virus? Because, uh, yeah, the, the dumpy chick should be turning into one by now. And the hot chick should be one as well, unless she gets eaten whole. Sonic Frontiers is how you do Breath of the Wild Battle. Yes, the Sonic Frontiers gameplay was unbelievably bad. In the last stream I did, I reacted to that shit. And I was, I was blown away how bad it looks. I'm just glad most people seem to agree. Because if people are actually falling for this shit, which it would mostly be like autistic people, let's be real. I don't even know how Sega could possibly think, yes, this is a good idea, let's do this. But then again, that's like every Sonic Team game. Like, Sega just does not give a flying fuck. Sonic Team is the most incompetent developer probably in the entire industry. It's actually shocking. It is shocking how bad they are. And they don't care because the games still make money. There'll be enough autists who buy it. Guys, I'm, I'm losing it. I'm fading. I'm fading, guys. I think I, I need... I might have to chug this water. If game journalists did what I did, they wouldn't get review copies anymore. That's just the sad truth of the matter. Eventually, I, I don't know if game, I don't know if publishers blacklist creators or not. It's probably only specific ones. You know, like how Bethesda, Bethesda blacklisted a shit ton of people, right? 
I will be blacklisted from everyone eventually, because I'm just going to say what I think regardless, you know what I mean? Like, it's not even like they pay you, they just give you a key. Like, what? you really think a key? Like, oh, I'll get my opinion out a few days early and get way more views. You know what? Like, fuck all the people who, who think that's so important, alright? This is... How you know a review is questionable is if it comes out on release day, because they are incentivized to give a positive review, right? Obviously, I'm not, because both the times I've been given keys... Well, technically, I've been given keys three times. I thought the indie game was okay. What was it called? Sable, right? Sable? Okay, so Full Moon... Oh my god, it really is werewolves, isn't it? They actually unironically did werewolves, except they're not at cool werewolves. They're, they're scary. Do you think we will ever get a Resident Evil Code Veronica remake? Uh, probably not for a long time. The fact that they skipped it is telling me that probably not. Unless they decide to do it after the Resident Evil 4 remake. Because I just can't see them doing a Resident Evil 5 remake. Though I think that would be kind of cool if they kept the co-op anyway. I would, I would be down for Resident Evil 5 remake that just does a different take. As long as it's still at co-op. A computer. Don't tell me I had to be paying attention. Not so much a hint as a slap in the face. Fuck! I wasn't paying attention. Did any of you guys read the birthday note? Please tell me you read the birthday note. Did she? Okay. Oh. Fuck yeah. Oh. Thank God the game didn't ask me to remember it. Thank you. You did one thing right. That was the one thing right you did. Man, earlier today, I was like kind of bored and I wasn't sure what to play. I was playing, uh... I was playing Dead Rising 2 off the record, and I was having a great time. And then I started playing this game for the stream, and then then I hated myself. The most stream, the most people I ever had was playing Call of Duty Vanguard. I had over 500 people watching at one point in the stream, which for YouTube is huge. Like YouTube has very very few people with more than 500 viewers on the stream. Yeah, if you have like a million subscribers, maybe you could. Ex expect like 1500 people or something but live streaming on youtube is not nearly as popular as uh twitch this section of the game was erectile dysfunction <laughs> Sophia, say hi to the stream cursed, armed with hey silver and the first. it's okay when moon is full before why man why does this always happen i don't know is it so hard to just make a movie game where the characters are interesting and entertaining and the story is somewhat engaging on some level? I guess that's hard. I guess that's hard when you, you fucking can't hire one goddamn competent person. What do we think of all the so soy boys losing their minds over that Stray Cat game? You, you know, werewolf, I, I refuse to watch trailer of that. I mean, I'm, I'll probably have to. All I know is I heard of that being a game that exists, and I'm like, this is the most Reddit game of all time. So I, I just don't want to even look at it. I just don't. The fact that at 3 a.m. we're not going to be done with this, and I'm going to have to stream this a second time, is, is the most painful part. It's so painful. I know it's not going to be over. How does he put his skin back on? That's the thing I don't even fucking get. If your skin comes off, how does it come back on? Him. It all makes sense. That's why Chris's car was at the lodge that night. Travis was protecting him. That's why he followed us, and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter, because it was his fucking brother. God, it's so obvious. If, if, if Chris was the one that bit me, then... What? The camp that counselor is sense. the werewolf? Tomorrow we're getting out of here. I'm gonna get Travis's gun and kill Chris Hackett. Doesn't that, like, significantly reduce the stakes? Because there's actually a cure. Oh man, that's so... Fuck it, just take the gun. I don't care. If it causes drama, take the fucking gun. I want everybody to fucking die at this point. Nice try. Haha, uh -huh. I am whamming with the Glock. Bleed, shoot trip. Oh, should I really shoot him? Oh shit. Okay, I better pause. They actually let me pause. Okay, shat. Sh shout, shoot, if you want me to shoot. Shoot? Okay, I'm shooting. <laughs> oh, shit. Should've shot the left side, though. Slightly left. Shoot him again, then. 
Of course the woman saves the day. I don't know. I, man, this is... I don't even care anymore, man. Let him think about why he's in here. Okay. Travis will kill you. Okay. Well, I did say I was going to get everyone killed, so it's fine. This isn't part of that anthology series they were doing, is it? Um, no, at, believe it or not, this is like, I guess, supposed to be until dawn level of budget, but... Jone, it is not... It's not that good. All the female characters are unlikable. I'm gonna be honest. I may have said some choice words about some of them. <laughs> uh, and we've... In chat voted very early on that we're gonna kill almost every character. Well, they said kill every character, but I'm saving one character in particular that that we we've grown fond of, and some some here some people here are calling Kyle. Shotgun shells. He loads them with silver. Oh my god, there really is silver bullets. This is this is kind of dumb. I don't. I I'm officially I'm liking the story less and less. Like, the Wendigo wasn't that stereotypical. Hey. Didn't that guy transform what happened? I know. It was off screen. It's basically off screen. His skin grew back. Like, the werewolf transformation is all their, their skin just blasts off of their body. It looks really... The transformation's fine. The fact their skin grows back is fucking dumb. I I'm gonna be honest. Like, this is dumb.